Happy holidays and welcome to the latest episode of Real Reviews. Now, this week's reviews are brought to you by the filmgordon.com, where we invite you to experience film through the eyes of a true film editor. I am Tim Gordon, editor in chief of the filmgordon.com, and on this show, we discuss my views on upcoming films. You can also read or listen to past reviews either on the filmgordon.com or at Spreaker.com. Now this week on the show, we discuss News of the World, which is an upcoming Western drama, co-written and directed by Paul Greengrass, based on the 2016 novel of the same name by Paulette Giles. Now the film follows a Civil War veteran, played by Tom Hanks, who must return a young girl who was stolen by natives as an infant to her last remaining family. Now, a widowed Civil War veteran agrees to deliver a girl taken by the Kiowa people years ago to her aunt and uncle, despite the girl's wish to remain with her captors. They travel hundreds of miles together and face grave dangers as they search for a place that either can call home. Now, of course, this film opens in 1870, where Captain Jefferson Kyle Kidd, Hanks, travels from town to town, reading the news to anyone who will pay a dime for the pleasure of the 19th century form of entertainment. Whether local news or misses from back east, Kid enthralls audiences as much during that time as social media does for the masses today. Now, while on his way to his next stop, he encounters a dead body swinging from a tree and a small, young, unaccompanied girl who is orphaned and alone. Now, abducted from her parents by the indigenous people and raised in their language and culture, she is initially uncommunicative to the kid. And after his attempts to place her with a couple of local families proves unsuccessful, he takes it upon himself to find her relatives and take her home. Now, much like the Coen's Brothers Western drama remake from several years ago, True Grit, Kid must deal with the elements, those interested in harming the girl as well as other challenges to get her to safety and return her home, and to return home to his wife. Now, young Helena Zengel is solid as a young girl whose world is turned upside down and must rely on the kindness of a stranger while the two try to communicate and understand one another. Their relationship is at the heart of the story as they learn from each other, as well as learning to trust one another. Now, two-time Oscar winner Hanks is outstanding as an honorable man simply carrying out a duty. Not because he has to, but because it is, it's his choice. Now, after the chaos of service, he's interested in a simple life, traveling from city to city, entertaining people with tales ripped from the headlines. Now, over the course of his story career, Hanks has left his imprint on cinematic history with a slew of memorable roles, and his latest is yet another feather in his cap for one of Hollywood's greats. Now, whether directing big budget franchises like Jason Bourne, or action thrillers like United 93 or Captain Phillips, or even political dramas like 22 July or Bloody Sunday, the Western genre is a departure in one regard for Greengrass but reuniting what Hanks once again, he has an anchor to build his story. Now it's very refreshing to see people enjoy the social media of the 19th century. And Hanks is a gifted storyteller, even giving off a little of a beautiful day in the neighborhood Mr. Rogers by as he delivers the news of the world. Now much like De Niro, Washington, Day Lewis and others of his stratosphere, Hanks proves once again He's a cinematic treasure. I gave News of the World a B plus. Um, really, really thought that despite the fact that, you know, it had tropes and things that we've seen in the past, that uh, Hanks really is the reason to watch this. And this along with Greyhound, which he produced, or which he starred in early this year, are two more performances that show the utter versatility of this amazing actor. Now, make sure to follow this podcast by subscribing to our Film Gordon YouTube channel or follow us over at Spreaker.com. I want to wish you guys a happy holiday to you, and we'll see you on the other side. News of the World is on theaters and on streaming services Christmas Day, December 25th. You guys enjoy. We'll talk to you pretty soon.